You always get like that excitement when you visit something completely new. Elden Volcano. Happy Halloween! The last time we explored the surface for the very first time, we fell in love with Kikuis and we conquered Skyview Temple. We, we also got a 30 ruby reward for beating that sloppy slicing challenge. Very disappointing. Enough about that! Kukil, Kukil, where could that child have gone? Please, Link, won't you help me look for her? I've been looking everywhere, but I can't find her. I've asked everyone I could find for help, and a few people have said she's been spotted with some unknown person with a scary face. I think I'm gonna pass. <laughs> she'll, she'll, she'll get home eventually. She'll get <laughs> Please find my daughter quickly. Oh, not only do you have to find my daughter, you also have to do it quickly, because I'm not gonna, like, be waiting here all day. Huh? qq has gone missing? We've got to do something. I'll start looking too. Ask around and see if you can find somebody who's seen her link. I love that kind of... that that all of the other characters are actually aware of what's happening because in some of the previous games they've been kind of like all just doing their own thing and not really reacting when something happened to someone else, so I really like that idea. Did you hear? A child who'd been playing in the graveyard went missing. You believe it? Do you really think there are monsters abducting children in our little town? I don't know. Nothing faces you, does it? A child just vanished from our little village. Oh, she got mad at me. <laughs> Let me try again. What? So there's a chance she was dragged off by a monster? Let's not be ridiculous here. The monster business is going a bit far. It doesn't matter what I say, she still gets angry with me. Women, I guess that's that's a woman's thing, isn't it? <laughs> Do you believe in the Skylove monster? Do you believe in the Skylove monster? It's an urban myth. Yeah, well, I saw it, but I was able to escape by the seat of my pants. I was saved by my cat-like reflexes, I tell ya. Impressive. If you're smart, you stay clear of the cemetery in the middle of the night. You stay clear, so... <laughs> is this another chandelier situation? I think it is. Oh, look, it's the brave knight who slayed the chandelier. <laughs> I wonder how I'm going to lift all those heavy pumpkin this year. You cannot lift the pumpkins you don't have, you know? Yahoo! <laughs> I was just about to say, what is that big red beam? <laughs> well... There was! Oh, this is really exciting! It's misdirect. It's misdirect. He looks a little <laughs> narrow sided. <laughs> Stop, please, I beg you, don't hurt. <laughs> I thought so, I told you! I know how bad this must look to you right now, but I assure you, I mean no harm. We're just playing the scream as loud as you can game. My name is Petrox? Petro? Petrox? We're going with Petrox. While I'm certainly a monster, I couldn't dream of terrorizing the people of this town. My heart's only wish is to become friends with the lovely people of Skyloft. Ooh, honey, those nails. Oh goodness, nothing would delight me more than to become a human. And he's so polite too! Won't you please gather gratitude crystals and show them to me? Of course. Uncle Bats told me he wants to see all the gratitude crackles he can. He's Uncle Bats, and it's gratitude crackles instead of gratitude crystals. <laughs> Kugel is safe back home, and it's all because of you. I don't know how to express my gratitude. You could give me a gratitude crackle. I got five gratitude crystals. Okay, so I now need to go back to him after just being there. Here I am. It's been five minutes. Oh, you've gathered quite a lot of gratitude crystals, haven't you? How magnificent! The medium wallet. It allows me to store 500 rupees. Okay, can you tell me what my next goal is? When I have 10. Okay. You always get like that excitement when you visit something completely new. Elden Volcano. Your shield broke. <gasps> Oops. Sounds like an, a monkey. <laughs> what are those? Completely sounds like a monkey. Wow, you took out every last one of them. Let me give you something in return. Give me a bomb bag, please. Digging mitts. Oh, 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 hey, oh, I've got skills, you know, you know.
The name's Tupert. Nice to meet you. I run this little game I'd like to call Thrill Digger. Want to try it? I want to give it a go. Yeah, 30 rubies. Could go kaboom. So, uh, good luck. How am I supposed to know? It's a matter of luck, huh? Okay, 20 rubies. Finish. <laughs> that was quite fun. I'll try again. And I think I'll go with intermediate this time. Rupor, I wish you lost 10 rubies. Oh, I got 20. Oh, another one. And a bomb. <laughs> Look, there's lots of spots that weren't. Ah, oh, this is the Zelda version of the casino. You can go and you can win a lot and you can lose a lot. Here we go. This one is a good one. Oh, five. Another five. I'm sure they buried it around here someplace, but I can't find it. They busted up the key to that door and hit the pieces all over the place. Hmm. Oh, oh, oh. It worked. You got the first piece of the key. Find all five pieces to complete the key and open the door leading into the temple. Oh. <laughs> what? Here? Oh. Now you can open the temple door. So far, so good. That's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. The next time we will be opening the door to the temple and exploring the temple. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you the next time. Hi, we're back. No way! I can roll it? My own little taxi ball. <gasps> Don't fall off. Oh, that's the, uh, what are they called? Muggle, muggles, muggles? Oh, and it's completely silent. Ooh. Okay. What? <gasps> Pure Indiana Jones. Okay. <laughs> I'm rattling. <running. laughs> oh, that's brilliant.